we're going to take a quick look at the SQL SO account. I've actually onboarded a SQL account here. Okay. I have done just the very basics. Set up the database and the platform is there. I enabled that and I've created the safe. And I've just got the name. I don't have the port database, nothing else. We're going to then go to here, to the platform. All I've done in the platform is to actually uh, all I've done is actually gone and enabled it like that. So I went and activated it. And then we're going to manage it now. We're going to manage the connectors now. We can let these are the default connectors that are already there. We're going to leave that. We are going to edit our edit them, create a new one from these ones in the 13. Dot, this is running 13.2. So we're going to connection components. We have our SQL SQL management. That is for Windows authentication. We're doing an SA account, so we're going to use the database one. So we're going to copy that and Paste it there. So we'll studio management dash. Put in that dash eighteen. So we'll studio eighteen. We are going to go into components. And to a few of these. That to 500. We are going to take that out. We have to replace the SQL Studio with the latest dispatcher because we're going to actually be using 18, as you said, see here. So we've gone and installed 18 on our PSO server. We don't need to change anything else except we're going to change the A few things around. It's up top application that's going to run. Let's check what else we need to look at. I think that's everything. So we can follow that. Click OK. So we jump to our PSM server. Back to once our hardening, we're going to edit some stuff in there soon. Let's go to C drive, installation files. I've downloaded the and taken from the from my from the marketplace. I'm going to copy that and back to Running to PSM components, paste, paste, go back, jump here, go back to PSM hardening, and to the hardening. We're going to need to go into PSM app buffer, XML file, edit. Notepad, you scroll down. Okay, these are this is the SQL one I've edited from up top. Okay, so I'm going to take up my lines here and my line here. So I've gone and looked for that full path. So we go to Program files.
Microsoft SQL Server. Management Studio 18, Common 7. Then we go IDE. Then we go SME. Then we've got to make sure that there is a file that we're going to execute the publisher. Then we come down, we need to add PLLs. We need to add comment that. And comment that we need to go and open up our DLL files for it to be able to run. So our DLL files are in ID packages and we also need debug. So we go to comment seven ID packages debugger we need to allow the DLLs to run in here as well. Then we're gonna save this. Jump back, we're gonna run run our App blocker. This is the the one from that from here, SQL Studio. If you can import it, you can import it. But you need to make sure you do your timeout. Value is appropriate. This one. Interim setting. Between 500 and 800 works. There we go. Looks good. All set. We do have a SQL Studio installed here. That's going to open up here. Our database lies on that server there. So make sure it works first before we carry on. SA and our password. If we remember it. There we go. Logs in and it's connecting from our PFSM server to our SQL server, which is running on server 2. We go back, we can restart our PSM service on our PSM. We start it. So PBW, go back to account, go back to connect, wait, let's go check the, we got to add it to the, we got to still add it to our platform, the databases, manage, and it's been associated, associate, save, Restart. Back to PBWA. Go to accounts. Our SQL account. Let's check. Why is it not there yet? Let's check. Come on. There we go. Databases, server, okay. SQL, associated, save, there we go. Hopefully that's saved this time. Let's go back to our PBWA accounts. Studio Management 8, click OK. There we go. Let's see whether it connects. Our PSM is connecting. 
initializing SQL Studio. Go team. There we go. Looking good. Connected with the SA account. Now our SA account has been recorded now. Let me log in. So that's whatever we're going to do is recorded. That's that. We haven't, I haven't set up monitoring or anything yet, so we won't, haven't set up. But that's working. Okay, this is it.